A car accident yesterday afternoon kills one Clay County teen and sends another to the hospital. News 10's Gina Glarell spent the afternoon at the scene talking with the victim's family, friend, and those who witnessed the tragic accident. 17 year old Troy Jeffrey II found himself in his very first car for the first time yesterday. He got in the car and he looked at me and he, the biggest smile that I've seen him smile in a long time. He got his job, he's got his job and he's just been so happy. Jeffrey and his friend, 16 year old Dylan Dorn, were driving at high speeds in Brazil. They lost control at this intersection, White Rock Road and South Levitt Streets. Sandra Bratton heard the crash from inside her house. All of a sudden, it just bang, bang, bang. And I'm oh like, I can't understand what that is. And I the car hit a nearby fence and killed a family's pet donkey. Jeffrey was pronounced dead at this scene. He was the best brother anybody could ask for. He was my best friend. Dorn was airlifted to Indianapolis Hospital Trauma Center and is in good condition. A tragic accident leaving many of those close to him never the same. He was there when I needed him. If I needed somebody to talk to, if I was upset, if I was down, he cheered me up. They say although they've lost a part of them, they called themselves the Three Amigos. They will never forget. In Clay County, Gina Galero, Snooze 10. Residents say they've seen many accidents at that intersection. They hope to get a stop sign put in place to make it safer. Jeffrey's family and friends are collecting donations for his funeral services. Now, if you'd like to help, you can go to our website. That's WTHITV.com for more information.